Hey guys, so today I'm here to do a review of the Bravado Bell Underwire Nursing Bra. So as usual, I'll just be going over some details for you guys, and then I will be giving you my thoughts and opinions at the end of the video. Of course, you'll be seeing overlay clips of all kinds of details about the bra, but I'm just going to go ahead and jump in. So this bra retails for $52. You can find it on their website, Amazon, Nordstrom. I'll have links down below. It comes in three different colors, although one is a limited edition called Amethyst. Super gorgeous. It has lace on it. Definitely check it out if you're looking for a little bit more of a sexy nursing bra. And then there is also nude and black. So as far as sizes available, it goes all the way from 32B to 32H. I'll be inserting a size chart right here so you can see all the different ones it covers. I did want to say that Amethyst does come in select sizes, so it's not in every single size. But yeah, wide range there. About the bra itself, it does have that petal soft fabric that you guys have seen on that ballet nursing bra of Bravados, and it is so, so soft, like butter. The cups are lined with foam. You can also make the straps into a crisscross in the back, and there's also a bra extender included with that, so in case you need a little bit more room, you've got it. Of course, that fabric, along with it being the petal soft, it's stretchy just like all Bravado bras, so it can grow with you. As always, Bravado has tested their fabric by this company to make sure that there's no harmful chemicals to be around you or your baby. And this bra is compatible with their clip and pump bra. I've reviewed that in the past and that's just a hands-free pumping bra. You're able to use that with this bra. So on to my thoughts and opinions about this bra. A lot of you might know that I actually tend to stay away from underwires. I've just had bad experience, first of all, with buying only one because I bought one years ago and I was done. I never wanted to do it again. I paid 30 plus dollars at Target. The fit, the sizing, everything was horrendous. Just the experience in a whole was a mess and I just never wanted to do it again because 30 plus dollars was a lot to pay for a bra that I hated. Now this bra is $50 and it's just so much better than anything I could imagine. Now I typically pay $50 anyways just for my regular bras. I find that when I invest in my bras, they reward me by not being painful or crappy or fall apart after a month. And I don't mind doing that. I'm pretty used to it. It's just always worked for me. So I love the price point of this. I do think that it's reasonable, especially for what you're getting. I love the look of it. It is a more like modern take on a nursing bra that has an underwire. It's not grandma looking. It's not gimmicky, especially the amethyst. If you're looking for a more you know, sexy nursing bra, definitely look into the amethyst. It's got a little lace going on. It's gorgeous. But like I said, it is a limited edition, so they'll only have it for so long. I love the rose gold detailing. I just feel like it's modern. Rose gold is what's in right now, and I love the fact that they included it on this bra. It's really, really nice. Of course, as always with the petal soft fabric, it's just like butter on your skin. It feels the best back here though. This band, it's not digging, it's not riding, it's not pulling on your skin at all. It just feels so, so nice. I was really nervous about wearing the bra because I have gotten clogs in the past from underwire. However, I did not have any. I was really kind of nervous the whole night. I was even like touching my boob under there trying to feel if I already had any. And I got home and I actually told Mark, be prepared, I might have a long pump session. I'm probably gonna have a clog. I didn't have any. I emptied my normal time and even he looked over at me and he was like, oh, you didn't have a clog? Like he was surprised. And I was so sure that I was gonna have one, but I think it's because their underwire is super, super flexible. It's really nice. It's like the support of an underwire, but it's not rigid, it's not hard, and I really think that's the reason why I didn't end up with a clog, is because it was so comfortable and it's not like a super thick underwire. I typically reserve this bra for when I'm going out, I'm wearing a dress, I'm at weddings, I want to look nice or good for my husband, if you know what I'm saying, and I love it because it does offer the support of the underwire. It makes my boobs look spectacular. The crisscross in the back will add even more support, and I really do like that, especially, you know, because some dresses I need that crisscross in the back. And quite honestly, this is more comfortable than the other underwire bras that I own, like the regular ones that I would typically wear. This is just so much better. 
So I am all around thrilled with this bra. I would definitely recommend it, especially if you're looking for something with an underwire, you need it to be supportive. And one last thing that I wanted to mention is that the cups do fall away pretty easily for me. That was something else that I hated with the old nursing bra that I had with the underwire. It would try to flip up constantly and I had to like try to peg it under my arm and then hold that there and try to pump. It was super awkward and I hated it. However, with this one, I think it might be because of like how soft the fabric is. I don't really know but it bends away super nicely so when you do have it unclipped you can just fold it down and it's it's so so nice all around this thing is super comfortable it provides like great coverage too like my boobs aren't hanging out everywhere which is as a large chested woman is a relief so I love this bra all around it's a great one if you're looking for one that's very supportive and you just yeah, you're looking for an underwire bra. I don't know what else to say about it other than it's great, as usual. Like I said, I will have all kinds of links down below for you guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks for watching.